Welcome back to another episode of the Vantage Point Vlog. And in this episode, we're going to do our first unboxing. Well, the current news is obviously that our latest single end of the line is now available to stream on the digital platform of your choice, with Spotify, Amazon, Apple, Deezer, etc. So hopefully you've had a chance to listen to that and uh, maybe you've even listened enough times that you know all the words off by heart. I must know people from all his friends. Again, because I've forgotten the word. <laughs> right. Well, obviously, uh, unboxing videos are all the rage on the internet, so we've uh, decided to join in for our first vantage point unboxing. So I'm going to open up this and see what excitement is held within. Excitingly, it seems to be some cardboard. And here we are. It's a whole bunch of copies of the new Vantage Point album. All right, so yes. It's a copy of our new album on Target. As you can see, we uh, we went for the, the James Bond style artwork. Although the, the, the Robin Hood style, which came out with the single um, on Target recently, we've stuck on the back. And we obviously included the track listing. And then inside, we have the, the artwork from I just want you, obviously, we decided um, the artworks with Abby Long was much nicer to look at than pictures of us. So you've got that there with the credits, who played on the album and who did what. This page, we've got some artwork from songs which were singles. And then in here, we have a CD. There it is, using our wee logo from the Daredevil in the Shore days. Vantage Point on Target. So that's our new album. And you'll be able to purchase that when it's released, which is in uh, January the 7th. Uh, hopefully it should be out on uh, all the digital platforms then as well. So that's our new album on Target. So for this episode's guitar riff, uh, Liam is playing the track Obedience School, which I think was inspired by um, Barbara Woodhouse. And then um, the song of course features on the, the Tomb of the Eagles album, which you can uh, listen to wherever you wish. So here is Mr. Kane and Obedience School.
For this episode's delve into the archive, we're going back to the studio in, I think, 2010. It was for the song Wishing Well, which was on the Two of the Eagles album, which came out in 2011. So I assume it was either early in 2011 or more likely in 2010 when this clip was recorded. And it's me recording guitar for, as I said, the song Wishing Well. And this is one of only two bits of music I've played from Vantage Point, which would probably be considered lead guitar playing, as opposed to just rhythm guitar I normally do. you're keen to know is, can this little motor man jump these copies of the new Vantage Point album? That would be a no. Let's try this one. Again, still a new. Yeah, slightly better. We'll have one more go. So, to answer your question, that would be no. Alright, as we're in uh, December, I thought we should maybe do a Christmassy top five or something. So we're going for the top five Christmas albums. Number five, we have Winter Songs by Rob Halford, which is just utterly rubbish. Um, I can't remember what any songs on it are because after listening to it once that was more than enough and only a couple of token listens since. Number four, Not So Silent Christmas from Ario Speedwagon. Um, it's a bunch of traditional songs but they're just played very nicely and boringly. You want, when you're when you're rocking up some Christmas tunes, you want a bit more cartoon rock involved and there's not any of that there. At number three, Merry Christmas Everyone from Shaky, which includes the classic track, plus some others, some traditional, some, some original Shaky tunes. At number two, Metal Christmas, star of the show in this is Paul Diano, 
in particular his rendition of Santa Claus is Coming to Town and there's other um, budget British musicians on that as well and at number one if you do want some cartoon rock in your festive period then a Twisted Christmas is the way to go and not only and it really is Christmasy because as you can see outside or maybe you can't it's just started snowing as I film this how amazing so I think that's all from this episode and obviously look out for our new album in January keep listening to the end of the line until you know the words and if you haven't already please do subscribe and you're more than welcome to hit the like button on this video you can hit the dislike as well if you wish and we'll see you in episode 16 it's the end of the line it's the end of the line